protecting people with policy, y'all. How are y'all doing? Good? That's great to hear. I hope y'all are doing good. I'm talking to y'all like I can hear y'all back. But anyways, before we begin, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Turn on post notifications so you're notified whenever I post a new video. And y'all, make sure y'all follow me on my social media. Like I say that in every video. I need y'all to follow me on my social media because that's where I post updates. And I don't know if y'all know, I, I interviewed presidential candidate Vivek Ramaswamy. So be on the lookout. It is supposed to be posting this Sunday. I don't know the date this Sunday. Is it the 20th? Yeah, this Sunday. So by the time y'all watch, this is going to be before Sunday. So be on the lookout. The interview was amazing. Um, it was really, really good, y'all. I'm not even going to hold you to it. It was really good. Um, I'm going to do a reaction video on it. So I'm not going to say too much, like I said last time. But just make sure, just make sure you stay tuned. You, could, you know, you, you, God is blessing. God is blessing me. He makes no mistakes, point blank, period. So what we're going to watch today is Oliver Anthony, Rich Men North of Richmond. Um, apparently, this is an old video, but apparently it's resurfacing or going viral or something. It's like a, another version of try that, try that at a small town people are comparing it to. So I'm doing a blind reaction because I did a blind reaction to try, um, try that at try that in a small town and some people were saying well a lot of people actually agreed with my reaction because i didn't find it racist personally me personally we all have different opinions i didn't find it racist so a lot of people are agreeing with me i had a couple of folks say that oh i was missing the point or whatever i still disagree with them but you know we we agree to disagree we move on so i'm doing a blind reaction on this um to see what this is about and yeah i'm actually kind of excited it's not too long it's about three minutes so we're just gonna get into it well, i've been selling my soul working all day Ooh. overtime hours for bullshit pay so I can sit out here and waste my life away Drag back home and drown my troubles away It's a damn shame what the world's gotten to For people like me, people like you Wish I could just wake up and it not be true But it is, oh it is, living in the new Look out for miners, and not just miners on an island somewhere. Lord, we got folks in the street, ain't got nothing to eat, and the whole beast milking welfare. Well, God, if you're five foot three and you're 300 pounds, taxes ought not to pay for your bags of fudge rounds. Young men are putting themselves six feet in the ground, cause all this damn country does is keep on kicking them down. Lord, it's a damn shame what the world's gotten to for people like me, for people like you. Wish I could just wake up and it not be true, but it is. you know but i know that you do because your dollar ain't shit and it's taxed to no end cause the rich men north the rich men Selling my soul, working all day, overtime hours for bullshit pay. Oh, 
Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. I was writing as I was going because I didn't want to keep stopping it because the video is only three minutes. But y'all, oh, wow. Okay, so for one, his voice is angelic. His voice is very, very beautiful. Two, this isn't, I don't know how people are comparing this to try that at a small town, mainly because it's like they're talking about two separate things in a sense. Um, yeah, they're like two separate vibes. Just because they're both country doesn't make it correlate. So I don't know why people are comparing the two. Three, some stuff he said that I wanted to write down so I don't forget. Mine is on an island somewhere that they only care about mine. They don't. They only care about minors on an island somewhere. I caught that. And if you know, you know. Because, no, he hit that. He hit it with that line. Because in all honesty, we already know the stories, how U.S. is going, like people in high positions when it comes to child sex trafficking and so forth. And I'm glad he called that out. Second point, how he talks about the high homelessness on the streets. A lot of these issues that he are t he's touching is in like a Republican or a Democrat issue. This is like people, everyday people issues that we are seeing that we want to, we want it fixed and we need help with it. But people who are in power aren't prioritizing the people who are in the most need. They're just prioritizing their personal gain, personal power, personal funds and going from there. Third, they all want how he was um, speaking about how they all want total control. It doesn't take a rocket scientist to know. Come on. It's facts. Nothing but facts and last. How he says he's so selling his soul for a BS pay just to make it. Y'all. Did he lie though? Did he lie? I didn't hear one lie. Did you hear a lie? I didn't hear a lie. I think the world right now, this country specifically, well, the world, obviously, but specifically in this country, people are crying out for help. This is why I lean more progressive when it comes to proposals and policies that surround our economy, specifically. I don't think we were, I don't think God, God knows we're maneuvering in a fallen world. We are all we have in regards to um, maneuvering in this fallen world until God comes back and takes his followers. We, we have to work amongst each other. We can't have, oh, the high class, low class, middle class, this and the third. We have to have, we all we have is each other, y'all. And I think we lose that in, in the midst of conversation. People are always about me, 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 especially people who aren't blessed with a position of power to make things change. They're all about them, 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 them. personal power, personal gain, and not looking at something bigger than themselves. That's the biggest issue right now. I loved his voice. I loved this video or like this song mainly. Um, it's going viral. I can see why it's going viral. Um, it was beautiful to me. I loved it. I want to know your thoughts on the comments down below. Um, yeah, yeah. I, 10 out of 10 for me. He spoke nothing but facts and it ain't nothing that we, ain't, we haven't heard before. He didn't say anything we don't know because everybody, everybody would agree with that. But go ahead and comment your thoughts below. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe. Turn on post notifications so you're notified whenever I post a new video. And make sure you follow me on my social media. I appreciate y'all all. I love y'all. God bless y'all. And this is Uduak, connecting people with policy. This is. Oh, no.